Good morning. My name is Anisio Gang. I'm one of the associate pastors at Riceville United Methodist Church. During this Lenten season, we are going to have Lent weekly devotional, which will be centered around the book "Pauses for Lent" by Trevor Hassan. Each week, we will focus on a single word. And its corresponding scripture passage for reflection. This week, our chosen word is water, and our scripture reading comes from John chapter four, verses thirteen and fourteen. Every one who drinks of this water will be thirsty again, but those who drink of the water that I will give them. Will never be thirsty. The water that I will give will become in them a spring of water gushing up to eternal life. Amen. Water is one of the most powerful images that Jesus used to describe Himself. When Jesus calls Himself our living water, He means. He satisfies our deepest thirst. Not only does this water quench our thirst, but it also becomes like a spring bubbling up inside of us, filling us with the life God wants to give us. For what do we thirst? To be thirsty is to long for love, acceptance. An affirmation. In other words, it is to thirst for a heart-to-heart -heart connection with the living and loving God. Jesus invites those who thirst to come to Him and drink His life-giving water. To drink from Jesus is to receive His Spirit in our lives. The water Jesus offers makes our lives new. So this week, whenever you drink water, say this prayer: Lord, in my thirst for you, give me your water of life. And every sip of water can serve as a reminder of the living water. Of Jesus.